Hi. I decided to do a video. This is my first video on uh, looking at a product. I had picked up this F800 GS at Cycle Specialties here in Modesto, California. And I was actually looking at getting a 1200, but um, Gail Weaver, the sales guy down there, talked me into getting the 800 because it was more affordable and it actually does what the kind of riding that I really wanted to do, which was hitting the trails, hitting the dirt, hitting uh, pretty much going anywhere that a uh, like a CRF 450 or something like that would do in the trail. But I wanted to be able to do um, 60, 70, 80 miles an hour on the freeway all day long, and this bike will do it. Very comfortable, I'm very happy with this. And I'll do a different video on this bike at some point. But I was actually, I went down and bought some boots. I was gonna go on a thousand mile ride, and I thought, well, I need to go get me some boots, and it'd be a good opportunity to do so. And I was looking at the Icon Elsnore, and I was actually just drooling over those boots. But Cycle Specialties here in Modesto had these down there. They just got them in. And I thought, well, what the heck, I'll try them on. And um, so I did. I tried them on, and they fit really good. They felt like they were already broke in. And um, I thought, well, you know, I'm doing adventure riding, so I think I'll just go ahead and get these. And this is quite a bit more expensive. The Elsinores were about $250, and these are about $450. Um, the only drawback is the Elsinores are not waterproof and these were, but they were so daggone comfortable that I decided I'd go ahead and, I'd go ahead and purchase these. Um, but there's not a lot of reviews out there on them, so that's why I'm doing this review. So I did, I, I, um, I bought these, I literally, the, the, the day I bought them, I put 500 miles on them, and turned around the very next day and put another 500 miles on them. And um, so I got 1,000 miles on these boots. Um, I did run into a little bit of rain, a little bit of water, um, not a lot, but a little bit, and I actually stepped in, you know, some deep water just to see what they would do, um, and they didn't get, of course, they didn't get wet, but I really never gave them a water test, to be honest with you, um, but I do like this boot, and um, the, the snaps on these are very easy to adjust. You pull them up, pull them out, um, and you know... What I like about it is when you put the boot on, a lot of times this lower snap, I've always had a problem with these, and they just snap right up. They're very good, very good quality. Um, and this liner is nice. Um, I was able to put my pants in there and tuck it in, kind of helps you out. And you can actually put this, very adjustable. So if you have big thighs, or uh, not big thighs, but big calves, you can adjust this. Um, and then make make the necessary adjustments with the with the actual uh, way the, the boot mounts itself. But the, the big reason why I really wanted this boot was because this this uh, shin guard here. Because I, I do I do a lot of um, standing. I love to stand on this bike, especially if you hit real rough area, uh, rocks and stuff. It's, it's easy to stand, and it's, this bike is made to stand. So I really enjoy that. And one of the things I found that I really liked about this boot is um, it was just very extremely comfortable. Um, a thousand miles, you know, when I got back, first thing I did was, of course, take my helmet off, take my jacket off. But I actually sat down in my chair and I just relaxed and had something to drink. And you think I would have taken my boots off first thing when I got back, and I didn't. Um, I mean, I did it in a little while, but I mean, it took me a little bit to take my boot off. It was uh, that comfortable of a boot. so. I would dec definitely recommend this. I'm very comfortable, very soft. Um, I like them so much, I'm thinking about getting my wife in here as well. Um, but they're very flexible. And so, not only is it a boot that you can ride in, but like if, you know, me and my wife, we go riding and stuff, we want to stop, do some shopping and some, you know, stores and whatnot. You can walk around in this boot all day long. It is that comfortable. It's almost like wearing slippers. They're so daggone comfortable. They really did their job on this boot. Um, and it, they're so flexible that when you're standing and you're pivoting and you're doing whatever, um, they do an excellent job. Good boot. Best boot I ever had. Um, I, feel, I feel very comfortable in them and I feel, I, feel, I feel safe. You're paying for what you get though. You know, If you buy a cheaper pair of boots, you're going to get a cheaper pair. Uh, you're not going to pay as much, but you're going to get what you pay for. But um, I think these these boots are worth every penny. They're a great boot, and I would highly recommend them. So, the Alpine Star Toucan—they did a good job on this one. 